I am very excited to be speaking with Representative Ross of North Carolina's 2nd Congressional District. Representative Ross serves on the House Judiciary Committee, the House Rules Committee, and the House Committee on Science, Space, and Technology. Welcome, Representative Ross. Thank you for speaking with me. It's so great to be with you. So the Congressional App Challenge's mission is to inspire middle and high school students to learn to code and pursue careers in STEM and computer science. So why do you think students should participate in the Congressional App Challenge? Oh, well, it's so exciting. They can put their ideas into action. So they might have an idea for an app that would make a big difference in people's lives or even a small difference. And they get to make it work and compete nationwide. The students who won last year in my second congressional district were so inspiring. It was a brother and sister, and they came up with a financial um, literacy app that helped people just do basic budgeting. It was so cool and they were so excited um, to be able to share that, not just with the second congressional district, but with the country. Yeah, that's great. And why do you think early intervention in STEM and computer science is so important? Well, it's crucial because our country needs more people to solve hard problems and to show people at a young age that we trust them to solve a problem. We trust them to make our lives easier. We trust them to use their skills to do something important. That gives people a sense of purpose. It makes them excited about learning and it makes them excited about going into the workforce. And so that's why I think the app challenge is so wonderful because it's an opportunity to experiment um, and to compete and to learn and to make a difference in people's lives. Now, as a member of the House Committee on Science, Space and Technology, what do you believe to be the greatest issue facing the tech industry today? And do you have any plans to work on expanding computer science education and tech equity as a whole? So the biggest issues that are facing the tech um, industry today, um, well, the ones that we hear about have to do with ransomware, which is very, very bad, and um, cybersecurity. And then there have been other issues that have come up um, dealing with antitrust matters. So I'm both on science, space, and technology and on judiciary. And so when we see people's innovation not be able to get into the marketplace in the United States, that's something that's concerning. So I know that's a lot of issues, but the good news is that I get to work on all of them. And um, my district is so science and technology oriented, they know that they have somebody who's a champion for that. And lastly, what is your favorite app on your phone? Well, my favorite app is Yelp. <laughs> um, because if I'm really hungry and I'm someplace I don't know, I'm guaranteed to find um, a place where I can have a nice meal or get my car fixed or something like that. Um, but it's not the app I use the most. I use the weather app and um, I also use YouTube a lot because there are a lot of speeches and things like that on YouTube. Well, Congresswoman, thank you so much for taking the time to talk to me. And to our viewers, remember the 2021 Congressional App Challenge is live, so you can register and submit your apps between now and November 1st. Thank you. Thank you.